Like any good sports writer worth his salt, Tony Gallagher's impressive career at the province newspaper, which spanned over 45 years, began with a bold pitch to the sports editor. A UBC political science student writing for the UBC newspaper in 1967, Tony approached province sports editor Don Brown with an idea to write game stories on UBC men's basketball. Offered a full-time job with the province upon graduation in 1970, Tony spent his first few years as a jack-of-all-trades, covering everything from Pacific Coast League soccer and high school sports to the Vancouver Tennis Beat and the Western Hockey League's New Westminster Bruins. It was hockey, though, where Tony really made his mark, and he was given the Canucks beat full-time in 1976 and worked it daily until 1987 when he became a columnist at the province. Known for digging up big stories, as well as occasionally burying players and coaches, Canucks GM Jake Milford bestowed on him the nickname of The Undertaker. Until his column's retirement in 2015, Tony built a reputation as one of the hockey world's most knowledgeable and connected writers. His work was so well respected, he appeared in the Hockey News and Sports Illustrated offered him a job, but he chose to keep his family in BC instead. Along the way, Tony covered 22 Stanley Cup Finals, three Winter Olympics, and several Canada Cups. He appeared as a regular guest on Hockey Night in Canada's After 40 Minutes, as well as on CKVU's sports page. He co-authored two books, including Towels, Triumph, and Tears on the Canucks' 1982 Stanley Cup run. In 1989, he hosted his own sports talk show, Gallagher on Sport, on CKWX Radio, and since 2001, has remained a prominent voice on the Team 1040, now TSN 1040. One of BC's strongest sports media voices, Tony Gallagher. Welcome to the BC Sports Hall of Fame.